What's going on guys? Dr. Typo here playing some Grand Theft Auto Line. So you will frequently see me doing gang attacks in a lot of my videos. I like to do them. They're fun to do and they're easy to do. Easy money, easy ammo. When I did one the other day, this happened. Did you see that? Kicked the gun and it fired. I've never had that happen before and I was unable to, uh, to replicate it. But you ever had that happen to you? You just walking through, you kick a gun, and it just goes off? Because uh, that, was, that was the first time it's ever happened to me and I thought it was uh, actually kind of weird. But anyways, so we have some new leaked information regarding some of the future content that will be coming out with heists. Um, I don't know why it's taken so long, you know, for Rockstar to actually just get on the ball and say something about it. However, you know, we have been able to just rely on players themselves to be able to get into the code and find new things out about the heists and what else is coming with them. You know, for example, more players had found out about the, uh, the Valentine's Day XP event, which is still, still kind of a mystery what that is. However, most people are pretty much assuming that it's going to be a double XP event. Now, while the heists themselves, you know, still remain a mystery as to when they're going to come out and, you know, other information like that, one thing we did find out is that there will be multiple teams per heist. And when I say multiple teams, you know, they're obviously all going to be like uh, co-op teams. Perhaps you've done a mission like this before. I think... Uh there's a Lester mission. I can't, I can't remember exactly what it's called, but there's one where you'll have a team of snipers on a roof and you'll have another team, uh, you know, making their way across the roof on the other side of the street. And, you know, that, that's kind of what this is going to be like. You know, there's going to be uh, multiple different teams, too. There's going to be transporters, snipers, lookouts, defenders, attackers, demolition, runners, gunmen, bodyguards, pilots, and drivers. It's, it's a lot of different teams to choose from, and I'm pretty sure, you know, that there's not going to be this many teams per heist. It's It looks like it's going to be, uh, and instead of all those, it's going to be four teams per heist, you know, and they'll just have, like, different specializations and different categories for them in the heist. And personally, I'm very happy to see this because I think that there is somewhat of a, you know, there's a little bit of a the co-op element seems to be lacking. Don't get me wrong, you know, you can grind out missions all day long, but they really aren't that, uh, you know, they aren't that intuitive, I suppose. They they aren't that challenging, and, and they're pretty much the same thing over and over, which I'm pretty sure, you know, heists will end up being like that after you've been playing them for, you know, 18 hours straight when they come out. But for the time being, you know, it still is new content, and the fact that it hasn't even been launched yet, it's still just a bunch of ideas. And then along with this information, we also have learned that there's going to be new weapons and such coming along with uh, one of these future updates. Things like uh, stingers, you know, I said something about that in a video before. I was really wanted to have some, uh, you know, some sort of a lock-on rocket launcher, you know, uh, surface-to-air missiles would be awesome is one thing. I'm pretty sure that I did say that, and it's coming, you know, a stinger. Finally, anyone who know, has played Battlefield, you know, or even, I'm pretty sure there's a stinger in COD. You know what it's going to do. It's going to take down, you know, annoying buzzards and police choppers and things like that. We'll also be getting a remote sniper. You get to play with one of those in the uh, the campaign to Call of Duty. If you've played that, then you know what the remote sniper is. However, you know it's exactly what it sounds like it is. It's a remote sniper. It's a sniper rifle you control remotely. That's uh, it's pretty much what it is. We'll be getting a new grenade launcher grenade. It's going to be a, a smoke grenade instead. We'll also be getting, you know, a bunch of other things too. I have put a, a link to both of them in the, uh, the description. So you can check those both out easily. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button too if you haven't already. Take two and call me in the morning.